want to hear with our friend Gwyneth Paltrow. She's got a brand new cookbook out today. It's called It's All Easy. And the title says it all. Delicious weekday recipes for the super busy home cook. Great <laughs> to have you back. Give us the idea behind this. You know, the idea behind the book was really, I was kind of polling my friends and saying, what, what do you need in your kitchen that you don't have? And my friends are all really busy. They're parents, they're working. And they said, you know, we would love a book that's kind of like a manual. We can come home from work and actually make something that's easy and doesn't take too much time. Just as quickly as it would be if you're just ordering in. Exactly. But healthy and, and great stuff as well. We used, we, we cooked a lot from your last book. Thank Can't wait you. to try this one as well. Tell, tell us what you're making today. So this is a really easy turkey meatloaf, which is great. It makes a kind of a big portion, but it's great for the next day. You can make a meatloaf sandwich, mm -hmm. take it to work. We, we were kind of looking for ways to multi-purpose and make things stretch. So it's, it's very simple. Um, you just take some turkey bacon, onions, throw them in the food processor, throw in the garlic and the thyme. Okay. Okay, and then. And you get the time. Oh yeah, there. sorry. And then I don't know how to work this food processor. This is not Karen. like my one, but. Did I no, get it it's down? not on yet. Okay, there we there go. We go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, nice work, nice work. He's and that's just, what it'll look like. Yeah, it looks like about that. You don't want it to get a paste, just mm -hmm. you know, a chopped up. And then you saute it in a pan, like eight minutes, something like that, until it gets a little bit brown. And then it's really simple. You put this mixture of the turkey bacon, onions, thyme, all that gorgeous sofrito <laughs> in there with some oats. This is a gluten-free turkey got meatloaf. It. So you got a little ketchup. And I probably should have whipped this up before I put it in, so I'll just do it now. A little egg. You can throw yeah. in the milk for me. Okay. And what is this, soy? That's Worcestershire sauce and some salt, and you literally mix that up. I got it on my dress, but that's okay. And then we're gonna add it to your ground turkey. And that's it, there you go. And oh, then you cooked. mix it all up, and then you stick it in, and then the very, and then you, you coat it with, so you wanna coat the I will do that. Yeah, and tell us about go. the mac and cheese. It's not mac and cheese, right? <laughs> it, it is mac and cheese, but I have, a, I have some cauliflower in it to try and make it a little bit healthier. Um, and when you put that in the oven, you put a little water in, the, in a different pan in the bottom, and then your meatloaf will stay nice and oh, moist and not crack. How do you so, get your kids to try the new foods? My kids are pretty adventurous in the kitchen. I mean, I've been doing, wow, that's beautiful. There you go. Um, Couldn't do the process, we could do that. <laughs> Um, they're pretty adventurous, but they do love kid food, like mac and cheese, which is why I added cauliflower to this to sort of sneak in mm -hmm. some vegetables. Um, and they're they're you know the, the the salad with the blue cheese they won't they won't try blue cheese they hate stinky How cheese. How about the dessert? You know I'm really proud of our dessert section. A lot of the book my my, my last book was completely gluten free and dairy free. This book is more, mm. you know, there's some cheese and some dairy, but our dessert is completely sugar-free and, and vegan and dairy-free. Yeah, yeah, dairy yeah, so that's, that's a good one. We love that little key lime tart there. It is excellent stuff. The book is It's All Easy. It's available right now. Thank you for coming Thank in. Thank you for having me.